know what guys today has actually been pretty good finn wolfhard was on hot ones today this is insane <laughs> now we get to experience a new 21 pilots era i feel like drew barrymore when she's out in the rain Maybe life is worth living. This is the best I've felt in months, and that's pretty pathetic. Well, my day was going good, and but there's just like this one little tiny problem, and that was I was in class uh, when this music video dropped. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. With the amount of self-control that I have right now, like not watching this YouTube video while I was in class, but I didn't. I did, however, listen to the song. <laughs> I know, I know, okay? I did not see the music video because I want this video to really hone in on the visuals. I can't really do the audio itself because I don't want to get copy, co copy written, copy wrote, <laughs> whatever. I don't want to strike against my channel. The volume on this video is going to be really low. I'm going to be talking over it the entire time. And I didn't want that to be my first experience of listening to the song. And I do have some couple notes on that before we get into the video the name itself overcompensate immediately reminded me my cat jumped on my bed immediately reminded me of this apple music interview where tyler talks about overcompensation where he feels like he's always in this constant cycle of compensating for whatever the last album lacked and so i think with entrench i look at the record directly following blurry face after that rise what I did was I tried to lump in a little bit more of dealing with that and compensating for that rise than I should have. I was trying to say, this is not a blurry face record. This is different. This is something I'm, I'm capable of doing something else. And I was compensating for the experience that I had, in a sense. I got that out of my system. And now I think that I, on this record, Scaled and Icy, I feel like I, I, I'm not trying to compensate for that anymore, but I am compensating for Trench because I went, it's a constant course correction. So that's why this record feels a little brighter, feels a little cleaner. It's, yeah. it's the songwriting is is a little more, you know, maybe it's a little more traditional. Um, and and so I, I don't know what's next, but I I would imagine that it's compensating for what I'm doing now. And I think that I'm always going to be zigzagging like that. Scaled and Icy was the last album that sounded very light and fluffy, and of course Clancy is going to sound very dark. Apparently, <laughs> I personally love the sound of this era. He did the red and yellow color scheme right. Really does sound like a trench and blurry face baby. <laughs> It's like, it's got that punch that Trench had. I can also hear some blurry face elements in it. So I really like that that sound is there. And also before we get into the video, I just want to talk about the album cover. <laughs> no, I was having a little goof and a laugh on Twitter and I was like, this would be so funny if they made this the actual album cover because so many people were like fighting over it and saying it was bad. When I first saw this album, it gave me like vintage rapper vibes. You know what I mean? Like, and even punk if you wanted to go there. So even then I was thinking, I have kind of an album cover that calls back to these sort of genres i hope they really play into that kind of sound it seems that is correct tyler's rapping on this so i can kind of defend the album cover in that sense because it's like you're trying to be one of those rap albums but, oh boy y'all have some heated opinions on that but let's get into the actual music video now ocean water Okay, I'm sorry, whoever said that this background looks like the Drown lyric video, you are absolutely correct. And I just want to say that the opening of this song is the perfect way to open this tour. I'm sorry, I'm going to be like trying to talk and look at the same time. And even though I'm a drummer and like multitasking is my thing, this is going to be impossible. Anyway, I could really see this being like the tour opener. And I feel like it would be a very, very good one. Like just imagine you're in the pit. And it goes, welcome to Trench. I think that'd be awesome. And I think that's probably, and I think that's probably what had happened here. Sorry, my video stopped. Because <laughs> Tyler talks about all the time about how he thinks about how these songs are performed live. And I think this one was made to be a tour opener, but that's just me. If my computer would stop lagging, that would be great. Okay, we're in Dima. Oh, we're in a red room. Okay, Josh, get it. Okay, we have some audiences here. Okay, you need to stop lagging or I'm gonna get mad. I'm gonna get really, really mad. This is why I, I, I live in the middle of nowhere and I don't have Wi-Fi. Okay, like what, what do you want from me? I live in the wilderness. Come on, <laughs> please, please. I've been such a good girl. Just let me watch the 21 Pilots music video. So we're in the red room. There's some seats here. I'm assuming this is in Dima. I don't know, I haven't really gotten into the lore yet because I'm just so excited that this arrow started that I'm like, I need to study this further. What is on Josh's neck? What does that say? Okay, we got the bandito lyrics. We have people watching. Okay, this is gonna be so me. So are they getting ready for a perform? 
What does that say on your neck, dude? Okay, they're wearing gray, so this is definitely Dima people. And my computer lagged again. Okay. Okay, so he's going through a door. I'm pretty sure we talked about that. All right, there he is, my little Discord kitten. Ooh, look at him. <laughs> I'm sorry, but he has little cat ears and it's cute. The egg Tyler is back. Oh, Josh Harryville? Josh Harryville? Question mark? He finally took that beanie off. You know when he took that beanie off, it was probably just like solid. Like it was like a solid piece of fabric. It had to be crusty. He was wearing it for months. <laughs> oh, I, I'm really liking the moves. I feel like people are going to be doing this on TikTok later. <laughs> and I also love Josh's hair. Man, you guys are, man, the fans are gonna look so cool this era. Oh, the going into the crowd and taking off the mask. That's very fairly local of him. <laughs> and we got our Josh Dunn lyric, it seems. <laughs> His little mask is so cute. I know he's trying to be cool and scary, and you are Tyler, you are cool and scary, but like the little ears, it's just, it's cute. I'm sorry, Pookie Bear. Okay, so the Dima citizens are, are leaving. They didn't like it. Damn, that's rough, bro. Uh-oh. I really like this part. I don't know the lyrics yet, I'm sorry, fake fan. Oh, so yeah, he's teaching a class. Interesting. So I'm assuming he's teaching the demon citizens about trench, the banditos and whatnot. That's really cool. Oh yeah, they have the tape on now. Okay, yeah, I'm liking this. Clancy just died? What happened? This is actually fake. Clancy did not die. Okay, scout and Icy's propaganda. There's somebody else. Oh my god, he was seizing somebody else the whole time. That's crazy. Then who was Josh? Was Josh there? Can Josh also seize? Are there two Joshes? That's interesting. Okay, well, I feel like I, that was an entire yap session because I don't, I don't want copyright, okay? Now they're trying to sell me the vinyl. Okay, I tried to get it, but the website crashed, so that's on you guys. Come in, little Gigi. Mommy's going insane about 21 Pilots right now. Okay, wow, uh, that was a lot. But it appears that Clancy is seizing people to pretend to be himself and teaching people about the banditos. And I'm assuming that these people are gonna turn against Dima, whatever. Okay, that is really exciting. You can see a kind of a parallel. I think the people that he's teaching are, are us. I really, I, I can see that parallel of Tyler trying to use his experience, aka Clancy trying to escape. Clancy is now teaching classes. Tyler writes music to help people. I can definitely see that parallel and I like it a lot. Oh my gosh, what a fun era. Also, when he sees people, was that like uh, just metaphorically like did they see somebody else and it was just showing Tyler because they wanted us to believe that it was Tyler or did he literally look like Tyler? If so, why can he wittily shapeshift? And also, who was Josh? Can Josh also see? But he's the exception. Too many, too many, too many, too, too many things to think about. I like the new era. You should also check out Fimble Fart on Hot Ones. <laughs> I'm so excited for this era and I know I'm gonna be making a lot more YouTube videos. I put it in my background. It's fine. I've just accepted my fate. Ooh, and now I must go study and really dig into this and maybe I'll do another video where I'm like really analyzing it because now I'm just like excited and I'm just like I got the zoomies, okay? I can't really theorize, I got the zoomies. But yeah, comment below, what do you think of the upcoming album and what did you think of the music video? I would love to discuss theories and anything else with you down in the comments. And as always, I will see you in the next one.